Hey guys, Sausage here, and welcome to Spore. Yes, um, after my Creature Creator episode, um, everyone wanted me to do a series, so here it is. This is the uh, Spore series. Well, it will be the start of the Spore series. Spore series. Um, I'm going to continue with what I said I was going to do, which is uh, an omnivore. Uh, which means they eat both meat and um, plants at the same time. It will make things a little easier. However, in saying that, I have to kind of get a media mediation between them both. I can't go down both meat and plant and have it too heavy in meat or plant. Same with killing things and being peaceful. I can't kill too many things and I can't be too peaceful. I have to keep a, a nice neutral balance. So, in order to do that, I'm going to have to think very carefully. So now I'm going to pick a nice planet. Um, currently, I'm looking for one that looks like pretty close to Earth. Uh, because we don't we don't want one that has red water. Uh, that's blue. If I can have one that's pretty close to Earth, that'd be cool. It's green water. Are these are the only ones we have. Yes, they are. So it'll have to do with this one. That's probably the closest we're going to get. Now, I could start easily in any of these stages because I've been through this game many times. Um. I personally don't like the cell stage, and it is a little dull. But in order to progress yourself, like in an entire get playthrough, usually you have to start at cell stage. So what I will do is I will show you what cell stage is like, and if I feel myself that it, it's getting a bit boring for you guys, a bit too samey, I'll just stop the cell stage and go straight to the creature stage. And from the creature stage, the game is fine. The game's fine from creature stage. Um, there's not really any other stages afterwards that I'm not fond of. I mean, there are some that are easy. I mean, for example, tribal stage here. That is extremely easy to do. If you gather enough food, you can get through that easily enough. Uh, civilization stage does take a little while, but again, pretty easy. And space stage is... Well, space stage. <laughs> not much else to say about space stage just yet until we get there. But um, cell stage. Here we go. Uh, it says, which one do I want to be? Carnivore or herbivore? I'll start off with carnivore. Might make things a little easier. So that's what I look like to start with. I don't know what this theme thing is. So if people know what that theme thing is, tell me in the comment section below. We'll play on a normal difficulty. Layla? Lalia? Lalia? This is where I get to name the planet. So this will be the name of the planet, not my creature. So the actual planet that I'm on. So, I am going to call this planet, uh, what shall we call it? Earth's twin? Because it is a pretty much a twin, no? That wasn't even Earth's twin. Uh, dirt. Planet dirt. Why not planet dirt? Uh, nah. We shall call it... Uh, Stygia. So we'll call it Stygia. Stygia. There we go. Stygia. Planet Stygia. Yes, that is a reference to a game. Planet Stygia. Perfect. And in we go. Hope this is recording. Really hope this is re Yes, it's recording. Thank goodness. Sorry, I had to check that, guys. Hey! A giant rock! There's Planet Stygia, guys! Woo! And... Come on! Kaboom! Yes! This is the very beginning, guys. All starts here. Our spore journey. Sit back, relax, and enjoy as we progress our way through and become an amazing creature. Now we're just a tiny little cell. A teeny weeny cell, look. From a nice crystal there. Teeny cell. And as a carnivore, I have to uh, eat these pink things, which is meat. Uh, I can't really control it with a mouse, so I'll use the keyboard. I can control it better with the keyboard. Much easier. 
Yo, eh. Actually, no, the mouse was easier. I keep forgetting. Now, I can kill creatures, but I won't. I won't be killing anything. I'm going to go from uh, attempt to go for more scavenger. But if anyone wrongs me, what I'll do then is I'll just slaughter them. <laughs> so, yeah. We'll try and get ourselves a nice um, guy here. I'm not quite sure on really um, how to play through this. Like, the, the path that I'll take. and so It's a good journey. Everyone should sit back and relax and get ready for the, the journey. And, I, and this is pretty much all the cell stage is. This is what I mean by it, it, it's being a bit dull. Because all you're doing is just eating and eating and eating. I know it's getting you used to things, but you just eat. And that is it. Oh, look. Uh... Okay, other cells and meteor bits are the key for getting extra parts. Uh, when you see the new part appear, swim over to the token and collect it. That is a new body part for those who don't know. Yes, I'm going to eat you, even though you're a carnivore. There you go, I just got a spike. Try not to kill anything if I can. Be as peaceful as possible. I mean, I want to be a peaceful race. Why not? Yeah. The reason I keep changing direction is they're that small I can eat them in one go, like the meat. Now I need to grow a brain. Not me, personally. But, um, uh, hey, that was mine. You see, I can't eat the green yet. I need a filter mouth. Or even better, a straw mouth. You can get a straw mouth eventually that turns you into an omnivore. So this is mostly the carnivorous path. Which means for the next one... Uh oh, did I just munch someone? I hope not. I hope I didn't just... Alright, eat that bit there. Eat that bit there. Go on, pop the, pop the bubbles. Eat that. There you go, we've grown. And now I should be able to call a mate. Yay! There she is. And this is where I first get to customise things, guys. With the spore stuff. Oh. What was that? There we go. Right, this is the cell creature creator. Now, you saw me do... If you watched the first episode, the prologue, where I asked if you guys wanted to see this, you saw me do a creature. This is the cell area. This is where you design the tiny little guy here. Now, I'm going to strip him totally naked. Because, like I said, you always start with a little blob. I don't think you can make this blob bigger, but you can make it thinner or fatter. and So that's the length it has to be because it grows. Uh, we will need this, which is a filtration mouth. Uh, let's put you like that. And then a carnivorous mouth on top. Nope, the carnivorous mouth has to... Right, we'll put you in the middle then. The carnivorous mouth can go here. Oh no, that can go in the middle. No, is that not in the middle? Uh, where are we putting that? I don't know. Let's actually widen that. That might actually help. Yeah, it looks like a little lobster guy, doesn't it? That looks pretty doody. Right, now we need spikes. These defenders. So if any would-be attackers come uh, come to get us from behind, they're in trouble now. Oh, actually, no, they can't be. I need sight. Right, we need some sight, so we'll put that there. So I can actually see. Make that a bit bigger. What I'll do is I'll make that like, make it look uh, streamlined, slimline. I was trying to say streamline and slimline together. And I need these to swim. Okay, so let's do a little bit of a blob there. Yeah, yeah there we go. Right, so that's me being able to eat plants and people. Uh, they need to, needs a name. The entire species needs a name. Okay, so for the entire thing, I'm going to keep a relatively similar name. So, for the cell, oh god, I'm yawning. We shall call him, he's on planet, planet Stygia. What was the other guys that I called? I can't remember now. Uh, I'm not very good with names off the top of my head. We shall call him the... Krazood. <laughs> Cra Zood. Krazood? Yeah, Krazood will be fine. Okay, so we've got the Krazood, um, which is what the name of my alien race is. Let's go! And this is all it basically is, guys. Um, cell stage, you just keep progressing through, eating yourself until you're super fat. Right, this has to be just plants. All plants. Can't eat any meat. 
It's the easier way of going through things. You see, it makes it hard. Because if you're trying to keep a balance, and everything wants to kill you, and you can still potentially kill them, bloody hell, um, it's really tough. Oh, we're super lucky now. Feast! This is just, like, full. Oh, I've got to be careful I don't pick that meat up. I was so going to gorge myself on this. Yay! Oh, this is so lucky, guys, to find one of these. One more. There we go. Back to meat eating. Ah! Stop munching me, you pernis. Ah. You see, I really need those things that he has, because I can't swim away that well. Eh. Eh. Nope. Screw it. Call him, mate. Quick. Quick! Ah, sorry! I didn't mean to hurt you. <laughs> if I call him, mate, I can evolve again. So, that'll be fantastic. Right. Next. Okay, so now we can afford these spikes, you see, because we have 13 here, they only cost 10. That means we can defend ourselves a bit. So if I do that to make it look like I can swim a bit better and add the spike directly there, maybe? And make them pretty big. Uh, now if I shrink that down and make that bigger, yeah, that's better. Oh, actually, that is being huge. It's amazing. Let's have everything massive. There we go. This guy looks pretty epic. Uh, put these on the side as well, actually, so if people decide to munch us, then that's cool. I think by now we should have developed, uh, or at least go to develop a second eye, so we'll do that. So as I'm progressing, my creature looks like it's slowly evolving. So there we go. It's going to make a second eye. So it's still a one giant eye, but it's a bit further apart. Now I should have a bit more defense. Now I need to eat some meat. Thing is, I don't have means to do that yet means I might have to kill things, which I would so much rather not do. Oh, you have to pick on me. Ah! Get it! Yes! Eat! Eat your dozy person! See, I'm killing this slowly because it's trying to kill me. Ah! No! I killed it! But it tried to kill me, so that's, that's a rule. If it tries to kill me, then yeah, it's fine. Come here! But I can't eat that unfortunately, it's too big. I think having the mouths on the side is a bit awkward as well, because it means I've got to spin to eat the food. But I did just get those new fins, which is pretty cool. Ooh. I just need to follow these guys and like scavenge. Which is cool. Because eating meat is so tough. If you don't want to kill anything that is. I mean, I could go ahead and annihilate these things to kill, to eat food. He has poison, which is cool. Oh boy, he's trying to get me again. Die! See, look, he can swim faster because of his fins. Ah! Ah, he has the straw! He has the straw that I need. That's an omnivorous mouth that can eat both meat and plants. It's fantastic. Fantastic. I think we need to just do some editing quickly because the mouse there is not going to help. And I might have to break the rule of killing things so early in the game because it's just going to be so tough otherwise. So what I can do is shrink that down, move that further forward. Yes, that's fine. And, uh, yeah. Yeah, oh, no. they were fine there. There we go. Right, there you go. Uh, not really much of an edit, I just needed to remove those things. I'll evolve again once I get another part of the brain. Um, I will probably need to start killing things, because finding meat is so tough. Plus it helps. There you go, it died. Kill. Eat. Yeah, it's much easier to do it that way. Right, um, I will kill things to eat meat if necessary. However, that will only be for cell stage. Plant stage is much easier to avoid doing that because there's plenty of food around. And people kill each other all the time in plant stage. 
Alright, died. Oh boy. Ow. Take it is. Let's kill this guy, if I can. And I can get poison at some point. Which is handy. Eh. No, if you get to the if you breathe in the poison it damages you, so I have to be careful. And they like to put their butts at me. Oh look, we're, we're bashing heads. Oh, I got him. But now he's swimming away because it hurt. Follow the poison trail. Follow the poison trail. I'll get this poison thing, even if it kills me, which I'd hope it doesn't. Come on. Come on. Come on. Ow, he killed me. No. Oh, no. The Krizu dead. Right. Let's try this again. Let's go for this guy. Hey, how dare you? How dare you? Oh, no, 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 don't breathe that in. Let's go for it. No, eat you. I want to eat you. Come on. Oh, he's got a jet engine. Die. I want to at least eat you because it heals me. Stop it. Ugh. See, even eating things can be quite tough. Oh, oh no, that poison always annoys the living hell out of me. And he just died as well. Where is that? That nearby? That would be fun. Ow! Oh, I got him! That's brilliant! Look at this dude here. Hi! <laughs> Jeez! Ah! Panic time! Oh! No, 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 don't get me, but... If I could get you, that'd be swell. Go here. Go here. I wanna eat ya. I can't eat you yet, you're too big. But he can. Uh. See, even trying to go for meat sometimes is quite difficult. Oh no, they're picking on a Krizood. Leave him alone. Come here, you. Stop. Munch. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Munch, yes. I got lunch, finally. Oh no, I'm eating plants too. Ah, keep away. Need to eat more meat. More meat. Oh, don't, don't bring that to me. Got ya. Sugar. Keep going. Wiggle that body. <laughs> nope. Come here. You know you fear the Krizood. They're gonna kick your tush. You're mine, you. You are, Pinky. Whatever you are, Mr. Pinky, you're mine. Oh, please be still up here. Probably swam away, bless him. Ah, there he is. Get him! Get him! No! Get this one! You're mine! Booster? Ah! Oh, I need some other way of killing them. Ah! Aha! That'll teach you! Right, I just evolved! Swim like he- Ah! I can get- ah. Stabella! No! No, Mr. Stabella! No, Mr. Stabella! I see those green guys. Those green guys are the guys I really need. If I can get that. Yes! And I got it! Oh, oh no, it was a jet. Damn it! I don't want the jet. I need the. Um... Oh, I thought, that was... I thought I had it. Yes, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one, there's one. There's one. Nosy. Yes, I need his nose. That's what I'm after. No, not me. Yes, 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 yes. And I got his proboscis. Right, that's going to help me so much. Okay, mate. Yes. This is 
This is going to help so much, guys. Right, I need to eat more plants now because I've been eating plenty of meat. Okay, I can get rid of that, and I can get rid of that because I can put that on. And then increase its size. Can I do two? Ooh, I can. Ooh, that's handy. Um, what else have I got? I've got these. Uh, we definitely would want two eyes now. We can have them down here like this, next to that, and shrink them down a bit. That'd be cool. Um, let's try and add the spikes a bit further up. Put those there. Add the spikes about there. Yes! Look at that. Make the fins massive. Um, shrink the eyes down a bit. There we go. Krizood are looking absolutely amazing, guys. Absolutely fantastic. So, what I'll do is I'll leave it here for now. This has been the uh, creature stage of um, Spore. I'm about halfway through. Um, if you liked this uh, beginning of this series, um, comment below to let me know what you do. Uh, let me know what you think. Uh, like it as always, and I'll catch you next time for more Spore. Hope you have a fantastic day slash evening whenever you watch this, and uh, goodbye!